At this point, all photos should have been turned over to the CIA. If you still have them, destroy them immediately or get them to the redacted. So according to Judicial Watch, the email is a smoking gun and it reveals both contempt for the rule of law and the American people's right to know. So why is Pentagon so desperate? Is it because the images are fake? Do the wounds not corroborate with the official narrative surrounding that Navy SEAL raid on the compound? Are they dated from previous years? Well, last year, Pulitzer Prize-winning journalist Seymour Hersh said that the whole incident was just one big lie and not one word of the Obama administration's narrative on what happened was true. And obviously we have other questions that persist, such as why the narrative and the timeline of the raid has changed multiple times, why the White House claimed that those situation room photos where Obama was watching the raid live, but now we know there was a blackout on the feed, why the neighbors in the immediate area said they had never seen bin Laden, there was no evidence that he was actually ever at the compound, and then of course that convenient buried at sea story, that that was the reason why no one ever saw the body, because they buried him at sea, even though it turns out that that wasn't an actual custom that was meant to do. So there's so many questions, and it's all just a bunch of lies, a bunch of lies to brainwash you into accepting whatever sort of reality it is that they want people to perceive. That's the uh, perception deception. David Icke was on the Alex Jones Show today talking about his new book, The Perception Deception. I really highly recommend you watch that Alex Jones, that portion of the show. It's up at the Infowars.com site. But it is just am amazing. He really breaks down how they are trying to manipulate your mind, um, manipulate information for this massive mind programming, uh, perception programming for the system to have their way. And that's why they just lie and they tell you whatever they want to say and the mainstream media will just pump it out. And if you don't do any digging of your own, then you are going to just fall in line with this perception programming and they're going to get away with murder as they did in Benghazi. And now it's coming out that uh, the White House a new report that's going to be put out on Tuesday, it's being released by the House Armed Services Committee. They are faulting the White House for security lapses in that Benghazi attack. I mean, they're just continually, continually being proven to be completely useless. Now, the, they say the White House officials either failed to comprehend the situation in Benghazi or they ignored the dramatically deteriorating security there while preparing for the September 11th anniversary. Well, we already know that they lied about the attack for weeks following, so it's no surprise that just as they covered up their mistake for checking the wrong box on the TSA no-fly list, that they would also cover up their mistakes when innocent people are killed, especially when they need to just push that story to the side so that Obama can win re-election. That would have been very inconvenient if that had all come out prior to the election. Basically, believe nothing they say. Everything that comes out of the controlled media must be scrutinized for spin. I mean, it is time to break through this perception deception. They are armed, they are ready, they are coming after, they're gearing up for war against the free man and free thinkers. So it is time for all of us to stay in attack formation. Now stick around because coming up, Jakari Jackson is going to have a special report. Unfortunately, it's just an update on even more police brutality. And then Dr. Group is going to share some health tips for you and your family to go ahead and protect yourself with this assault on multiple levels against the human. Introducing Pro One, all of your filtration in one system, portable, on the go. No more do you have two or three filters to just reduce sodium fluoride. You have a system that cuts out the sodium fluoride and up to 95% of hydrofluorosilicic acid. Advanced manufacturing technology combines silver impregnated white ceramic with new Aquamedics advanced media for removal of fluoride and other heavy metals, all in one filter element. It is the only one that does it and out of the gates. 
We have it discounted at 10% off with promo code WATER. This is the only system that in one unit helps reduce or remove pesticides, herbicides, chloramines, ammonia, and chlorine, hydrofluorosilicic acid, the most common form of fluoride not covered by other fluoride filter brands, and sodium hexafluorosilicate. Get your Pro Pure with the new Pro One filter today at InfoWarsStore.com or by calling 888 253 3139. The facts are in. The studies are legion. Sodium fluoride and other toxic members of the fluoride family are devastating the health and cognitive ability of the American people. So why are the social engineers adding it to the water? Simple. Dumb down the host population that the parasitic technocracy is feeding on. We may not have been able to get fluoride out of the water supply yet, but we can help to get it out of our bodies. I am extremely excited to announce the exclusive InfoWars Life Fluoride Shield Formula fusing six of the best documented ingredients from around the world to help the body remove not just toxic fluoride residues from the body, but a whole host of toxic substances. Let's take a stand against the globalist by blocking their poisons with Fluoride Shield. I use Fluoride Shield every day. Secure your Fluoride Shield and other pioneering formulations at InfoWarsLife.com today. Let's start cleansing our bodies now and support the InfoWar at the same time. That's InfoWarsLife.com. At some point, we've all been annoyed by a barking dog or a dog on the loose, and sometimes police are called in to handle these situations. But is this the type of police response that you would want to happen in your own front yard? And yes, once again, those dogs should have been under the direct supervision and control of their owner. But with a modern officer carrying things such as pepper spray, was lethal force really necessary? And let's stay on this topic of lethal force. What if the gun was turned the other way and the officer was in the crosshairs? That's exactly what happened right here in the state of Texas. Sheriffs looking for marijuana burst into a man's home and ran straight into gunfire by a startled resident, killing an officer. The resident was able to avoid a murder charge, but it goes to show that over-aggressive police tactics can backfire on officers. Over-aggressive tactics such as kicking a woman out of her own home. A woman was displaced from her home so a SWAT team could perform reconnaissance, much like we saw during the Boston bombing. But to give credit where it's due, not all officers are out in the streets behaving badly, such as in New York where they just busted up a New York crime syndicate with joint agency cooperation. So if we have more stories like this, police going after real crimes and going after the real perpetrators and not harassing the general populace, we can break free of this current police state. You can find more reports at InfoWars.com and PrisonPlanet.tv. Symbols are powerful, and the globalists have hijacked the symbols of America. They've turned them into their own symbols. Well, we are restoring the idea of the true republic, not the counterfeit globalist empire, by promoting the icon George Washington and others. That's why we're rolling out on a 100% Made in America line of incredible pro-liberty apparel. We are repopularizing liberty. We are helping fellow Americans. Americans rediscover what made this country great. We are the spirit of 1776. We are 1776 worldwide. We are all brothers and sisters in arms in the animating contest of liberty in the long march towards humanity's ultimate destiny of freedom. Visit MadeIn1776.com today and vote with your dollars to promote truly made in America high quality products and promote the ideals of liberty. 
Alex Jones here to tell you about how you can help spread liberty worldwide while also enjoying what I have found to be the best tasting 100% organic coffee on the planet. For more than a decade, my favorite coffee has come from the high mountains of southern Mexico, where the Chiapas farmers grow their unique shade-grown Arabica beans. We have now managed to secure the sought-after beans in a highly customized blend. Discover and try a bag of the Patriot Blend 100% organic coffee at InfoWarsLife.com. This coffee gives you a long, smooth pick-me-up for hours without the headaches and heartburn that so many other coffees give me personally. Hands down, this is my favorite coffee, and it's taken us years to secure connections directly to the Chiapas Mexican farmers. Drop by the site today, order a bag or two, and I don't think you're going to be disappointed. Available in original or with our immune support infusion blend, you will be supporting a free press, all the while enjoying a truly great tasting cup of my favorite coffee. Available at InfoWarsLife.com. Over the last several years, there has been a major health awakening on the subject of GMOs, water fluoridation, and the reduction of IQ, and just about everything that's going on. But the problem has always been a lack of concrete solutions that are free and easy to do being presented by you know, natural health experts across the world. I've always been at my mission to try and offer answers, but a good friend of mine, Dr. Edward Group, a key expert in detoxification, avoiding harmful substances, the whole nine yards, is here today to talk about five ways in five different categories we can completely eliminate things like stress, things like arsenic in the water supply, things like environmental factors that are leaching our health from us and destroying our overall cognitive function. And we're going to have a video series here, five different videos released on a daily basis on YouTube and also played on the nightly news at InfoWars. And we're going to discuss five ways to detoxify your body and change your life. So Dr. Group, let's get into the first, which is clean water and how to avoid all the garbage that's in the water supply today. Well, Anthony, thanks. Uh, when you look at the body, I mean, the body, any living substance, actually, the earth itself is composed of at least 80% water. So my health secret number one is to drink clean water. I mean, everywhere you look, when you go to restaurants, the food is manufactured with toxic water. The municipal uh, water systems contain toxic prescription drug residue, even radiation in some cities, uh, fluoride, fluoride, chlorine. I mean, the list goes on and on and on. So really, it's so important to feed your body clean, clean water. And one of the solutions with that is to avoid, some people think they get clean water by drinking colas with high fructose corn syrup, energy drinks, tea, milk, all these other substances out there that can be extremely toxic to the body, all these other beverages with artificial sweeteners. Now, when I go around and I talk to people and I'm saying, how much water do you drink? A lot of them say, well, I don't really like water and I don't drink water, yet if they take a tally of everything that they put in their system from the morning when they drink coffee, alcohol, sodas, all this stuff, <clears throat> Yes, it has water in it, but most of the water in there is actually water that's contaminated with toxic compounds in it. And it's not the type of water that your body needs, wants, or uses on a regular basis. All that does is just contaminate the body even more. And with our research, we found that approximately 90% of the people out there walking around are chronically dehydrated. Water is an essential, essential element for the body to function. So here's a simple and easy way to get clean water. Now, there's a lot of different uh, water purification systems out there available. People are drinking bottled water now, which by the way, gallon to gallon bottled water is more expensive than gasoline that you put in your car. I mean, that's a whole another marketing ploy, you know, poison the water and then we can come back and sell you clean water. But a lot of that water is still not even clean. So I have a simple technique that everybody's used that I recommend it to, and it's basically drink distilled water. Now, you can spend thousands upon thousands of money on a water purification system. And I do recommend a whole house water purification system, one especially designed to take the fluoride out as well. And those are available if you look for them online. But for drinking water every day, 
I personally drink distilled water with the addition of organic apple cider vinegar added to it. You're getting so many benefits. There's over a hundred benefits of drinking organic apple cider vinegar. The raw form with the mother in there, which is actually high in acetic acid, and it turns the body from an acid-based into a slightly alkaline, which is great. That's a, that prevents disease. Organic.